This is a Krata electric thermal storage heater. It uses electric elements to heat ceramic bricks, which then give off that heat during the day. We're going to replace the thermal fuse in the heater. This is model number 79161. And there's another way to figure out the model number if this sticker is missing or faded. We'll see that in just a minute. Step one, turn off the fuses at the fuse box. There are three screws at the bottom of the heater, and we'll just go ahead and remove those. We can now grasp the sides of the front cover, lift it right off. The knobs will just come off with the cover. Grab the sides, lift it off. And on the inside of this front cover is that sticker with model number, and power and weight ratings. The knobs came right off when we removed the cover. They should be tested to make sure they're not broken. Uh, they can be replaced with any knob that fits a standard quarter inch D shaft. Here's the thermal fuse. It's mostly melted out. And so we're just gonna undo this screw and this screw, and take it out and replace it with a new one. This is the new fuse installed. The sticker indicates Krita's old part number for the fuse. They've changed their part numbering. Uh, you can find the list of part numbers easily enough online. You can find the fuse for your model online. Uh, the 79161 uses a 177 degree Celsius fuse. Um, I think any fuse you can find rated at about 15 amps, 250 volts, and the appropriate temperature should work. Put the cover back in place, just angle it backwards a little bit, line it up, and snap it into place. Finally, just reinstall the knobs, put the three screws back in at the bottom of the front plate, and turn the breakers back on.